The Tampa Bay Seawater Desalination Plant is a state-of-the-art facility that produces up to 25 million gallons per day high-quality drinking water from seawater. The plant includes different treatment processes such as screening, sedimentation and filtering for pretreatment, reverse osmosis and blending for post-treatment. A power station located next to the desalination plant withdraws the seawater first and uses it as cooling water. The desalination plant catches the warm seawater discharge of the power plant where it flows at first through screens to remove debris. Afterwards, smaller particles that couldn't be caught by the screens are clumped together using coagulation and flocculation to form bigger particles. In the sedimentation basin, bigger particles are settled down through gravity. This process is enhanced by using lamella clarifiers, which increase the settling surface of the basin up to 10 times. AET provides lamella clarifier systems and engineering support. In case you would like to get more information, please use the link below to contact us. In earth filters and cartridges, the remaining very fine particles and silt are removed. Next is the reverse osmosis process, where salt water is separated from fresh water through a semi-permeable membrane. By applying pressure on the salt water side, water molecules move from the fresh water side and leave minerals behind. More details on osmosis and the difference between fresh and salt water can be found in the following video link. In a final step, chemicals are added to the desalinated salt water for stabilization and blended with treated drinking water before it's delivered to Tampa Bay consumers. Thanks for watching and if you like our 3-minute video tutorials, please subscribe and don't forget to give a thumbs up.